What's going on guys? It's Colton here. Welcome to another video. I am doing some Clash Royale right now, so I changed my deck up a little bit, so um here it mom. Gosh dang it mom! You have to interrupt the video again. Okay. <laughs> oh you almost flipped it. And, uh, so, here's my deck. Sorry for the interruption. So, uh, uh, this is my deck. I got it from a YouTuber. I don't, I forgot his name, but shout out to you. This deck is so good. I changed the deck up a little bit that he gave me. So, yeah, and the, this minion horde is so good, but I don't want to upgrade it just yet. And I got these barbs. Yeah, and this deck is so good. Even with the prints. Like, so, like, here's my strategy. What I do sometimes. If they give me the giant and the and the hog rider, see, like, if they give me the giant or the hog rider, I just put giant on one side, and then, so, I'll put the hog rider right here, and then the giant right here, but I'm not doing that in this round. So I'm going to put the hog rider right here, and then I'm going to put the minion horde right here. So that's going to, so the minion horde is going to defend the balloon, so we stop the balloon. And, uh, so I don't really have any elixir right now. He's going to, he's going to spawn down some barbarians. He's doing basically a mini push, but this is actually an okay push, I would say. But he got a lot of damage on me. I barely even did anything. <laughs> I'll, I'm gonna use my, uh, so. What should I use here? Should I go the defensive side? Oh, right there, right there, right there. Okay, uh, which? Build up elixir while he's attacking. And, uh, let's see what he has. Okay, he has a Valkyrie. I'll counter that with the Minion Horde. And then I'm gonna... Huh, I don't really know what to do. Oh, gosh, that was a lot of damage. I'm gonna put the Giant down with my, uh, Fire Spirits. So if he skeletons me, I could just take it all out. Okay. Okay, so you put the hat down. And then I'm gonna goblin barrel that because the he probably doesn't have any elixir. There we go. Now let's play some defense actually. And uh I'm gonna put down my wizard. Okay, please kill please kill the baby dragon. Okay. We did some good damage. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. Oh, oh my gosh. 84? 84 health? Okay, let's build up Elixir. And, uh, I don't really know what to do. And he just freaking got it. So, put that down, put that down. My usual strat. And I'm gonna put that down. Here we go. The giant is gonna do some chip damage. So I'm gonna put the musketeer right here. And, uh, I'm gonna put that down. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. Minion Horde. So it's a count of those barbarians. Here we go. Like that. And then... Sorry, I have this song. I have this song stuck in my head. Okay. Okay, we did some good chip damage. That was a lot of damage, actually. Okay, we're gonna... Put our wizard down to counter those minion horde. And then we're going to put that minion horde down and then the fire spirits. There we go. Let's go. See, this is like a really, really good deck. So I would, I would use this deck to your advantage. So, yeah. So here's my first one. You can see all this stuff, which, yeah, all this stuff. Basically, all, uh, a lot of this stuff is a counter to balloons. So, the 
fire spirits and the minion horde would be really good counter to to balloons. Sorry, I just started there. And then I got the mini dragon to like take out take out the towers and and be used as a distraction. And I got this fireball if I need to take out skeleton army or something. Hog rider to like use for the giant and hog rider strategy. Like put the giant in one lane and put the hog rider in the other. And uh, use the wizard for to counter the minion horde and the minions. Free spell to freeze the towers, like usual. And the uh, oh my gosh, this thing is so good. The goblin barrel. If you upgrade it a lot, it's like OP. And the barbarians, they're pretty, they're pretty good distraction, I would say. And these minion hordes, they're so, they're so OP. And this prince, yeah, it's actually pretty good if you use it right. <clears throat> like if you use it with a, with like a minion horde and a, I don't know, minion horde and some fire spirits. Hold on, mom. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, sorry again. I just got distracted. And, uh, I want to use the golem, but it's eight elixir. So, yeah. And I have this baby, I mean, lava hound. Sorry. And I got this P.E.K.K.A. I don't really like the P.E.K.K.A. Because it's so slow and it takes up a lot of elixir. But, same with the mus three musketeers. They're, they're really good. But they take, but they take nine elixir. So yeah. Ooh, this is in the shop. Okay. I never really check the shops too, too often because sometimes they're garbage. <laughs> and uh, here's my clan already. So if you want to join it when you can, please do. Donate a lot. That would be awesome. And we're all. We're pretty close to uh, our clan chest. I don't even know how to. I don't know how to use the clan chest, but tell me in the comment section if you will comment. And yeah, this is gonna be the end of today's video, and see you guys next time.